I got these flares after all. It's getting really dark over there. <gasps> oh no! Oh no, no, no! No, what was that? No, no, no. <gasps> Go over there. Yeah, yeah, follow the light. What is going on, everybody? Welcome to Narcosis. I'm your host, the Bird, known as Falcon. Uh, this right here is a game I have been eyeing for a very, very long time. It's unfortunately one of those games that went through a couple of delays, so I'm hoping that us as consumers don't just jump the gun and just because it was late a lot of times, we're gonna be like, oh man, it didn't live up to the expectations, but I do have high expectations for this game. I've been eyeing it for a very long time. This is a game all about an underwater setting, and that alone is the horror in the game. There's no supernatural things happening here. There's no like evil corporation or Cthulhu monsters underwater. It's literally just you in a deep sea setting. And I believe that deep sea settings are quite possibly one of the most creepiest ones just because we're not sure what's down there. Oceanova was once in a lifetime. They're breaking new ground, making something meaningful. Mining methane hydrate frozen beneath the seabed. There's alternatives, but none so plentiful. It's clean and safe. I couldn't say no. Sorry about your weekend, but someone had to draw the short straw. We've got a lot of updates to get through, but new suit, same rules. Give me a sec. Okay, instruments. O2. Flares and thrust. Oh, Jesus. Here, you know the drill. You're stressed, panicking, breathing hard. Sensors tripped. As you know, your O2 burns down a lot faster under stress. Anyway, let's move. Let's see. Scrubbers, check. Temp, check. Lights, check. Camera, check. Uh, okay. I haven't played this beforehand, so I don't know what's happening, so I'm keeping it very low profile with the commentary for now. Because I don't want to talk over the commentary in-game, obviously. Or the dialogue in-game, anyway. Oh, Jesus. Okay, that was just a deep water fish. So, I was being trained, but now I'm obviously quite underwater here. I'll be honest with you, this looks great. I mean, obviously, one of the first things that drew me to this game was the visuals. Just the underwater setting was very, very well done, at least with the screenshots, and... It does seem to keep that still intact. More importantly... It also seems like the performance is great, everything's maxed out, and I'm running into no issues here. Alright, I turned myself into a circle there, but we're fine, we, we got the right path over here. Apparently, just have to go straight. Oh, and I could actually- ooh, no. Oh, I got a knife now. Stabby, stabby. Okay, cool. So we have a knife to protect ourselves underwater. How far can we be, though? Like, under- isn't, like, after a certain amount of, like, pressure, you basically get crushed like a tin can? At least what limited knowledge I know about the sea. It's like, you can't go too far down, otherwise you will indeed get cracked. Okay. I am losing. Can't see. Something's still not... Hold on a sec. Um, I need you to hit thrusters one more time. Whenever you're ready. Well, what am I? Okay, thrusters. Well, I already figured out how to do that, apparently. Let's get out of here. Grab a little sunshine while we can. So, am I jumping between, like, the past and the present? Which is actually a really cool way to do a tutorial. Oh. Okay, so we're going down here. Oh, I get you. So. That little pass sequence was to teach you how to thrust in case you didn't know how to do it already. Okay. Well, luckily for me, I'm over here, like, practicing with all the keys just to figure stuff out, so... Dig at it beforehand. Oh, that's... that's awesome right there. Now, I gotta remember that they gave me a knife for a reason, so even though this seems kind of really cool at the same time, I have to imagine at some point... We're gonna probably have to defend ourselves here. Is it against you? No, not you. He swam away. 
He knew what was up. Okay. Well, my oxygen is depleting now. That's the problem. Are we going to the past again? No? You're getting kind of shady. Oh, is that a dude? That is a dude. Hey, buddy. What do you mean am I alright? I'm fine. I'm just learning my my steps around here, man. Robots all riled up. Don't want to miss that. I'll circle back with JJ tomorrow. Get this all wrapped up. That's a really bitching suit though, like for real. So that's probably what I'm wearing too. I like it. Very Warhammer-ish. 10.02. February 2nd. We were 50 miles from the epicenter. But an 8 on the Richter scale makes that kind of distance irrelevant. Why'd you stop? Hold up. Something's off. You seeing this? The shockwaves hit six minutes later, striking the south face of the hab first and hardest. 27 minutes in, with that kind of concussive force, even the sealed modules were compromised. After that came the ocean. By 1033, only safe havens in a sub or one of the suits. All right, that was just the introduction. Awesome. So there was a, an earthquake underwater. Or maybe not really underwater, which is an earthquake, but obviously the waters feel the quakes as well. Now we're very low on oxygen, which is uh, obviously a problem here. So we gotta look for a tank or a sub. Something, right? Maybe if we follow these. Oh no, it's my friend. Buddy? How can I help you? No, don't, don't, don't strike him. He's gone now. But why? Oh, Jesus! Oh, no. Relax. Oh, no, 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 no. No. Um, so my oxygen's, like... Okay, um, look, 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 look here for a second, my friend. I, I, I think we're, we're gonna die ourselves. Can I get a tank off of you or something? No, he, he's, he's boned as it is, too. Oh my, oh god. What is this? Yo, I gotta get a tank here. Oh, good, a dead end. Swell. <laughs> Swell. Oh, look, we were so close to oxygen. Okay. Well, now we know. But yeah, uh, there's a fear meter in the game, obviously, and if you're scared, you use more oxygen, and... Watching our friends suffocate to death probably would scare a lot of people. So, okay. Well, luckily, our checkpoint was right there. Cool. And that's our tank. Awesome, okay, cool, we're, we're fine. We're fine. We gotta die a couple of times to learn how it is, you know. Now, are you guys I'm interactable with? Doesn't seem so. Should I go up that catwalk? On the cat... No, I don't think I should. It seems to end right over there. So we're going down this way. Frankly, I don't even know which way to go, just because... There seems to be a lot of openings everywhere. uh huh, uh -huh. Oh, Jesus Christ. No, man, I, I have a thing about crabs. Especially giant crabs like that. Check your gear, trust your training. One of the first things you learn. But the second they fail, you fall back on what you know best. For me, it's the list. This time, it wrote itself. Keep breathing, find others, and get the hell out. Get back. 
I'm hearing so many freaking noises that, like, on my headphones is kind of creeping me out. Like, just really abnormal sounds. Now, I should mention this game is VR compatible as well. I could only imagine playing this in VR. Like, I haven't really played VR games at all, like, once. So I'm not even sure what the experience is like. But this here in VR, oh man. I gotta tell you, I'd probably be even more freaked out than I am right now. What, what's that over there? Plant life? Okay. Seaweed of some kind. Should be using my lights too, huh? I got these flares after all. It's getting really dark over there. <gasps> oh no! Oh no, no, no! No, what was that? No, no, no. <gasps> nope. Nope. Giant spider crab. I don't like it. I'm gonna hide right over here. Can he see me? No, don't don't come at me. Don't don't No. Go over there. Yeah, yeah, follow the light. Oh Jesus, he's It's actually It seems to be drawn to the light. Okay, look. I'm just gonna walk by you, okay? I, I mean you no harm. I'm not looking back either. You guys better not ask me to look back. I'm not looking back. As a matter of fact, I am thrusting the hell on out of here. And not even hip thrusting either. I'm just using my thrust just to just get on out of here. I am not looking back. If that thing was gonna kill me, it probably would've killed me already. Just thrust away. <laughs> okay. Oh! Oh, we're sliding now. Oh, we're sliding now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. Stop, my friend. All right. I think there's oxygen down here. Ooh. Is that from us? Gotta be from us, right? Are these flares? Oh, they're flares. No, don't, don't swipe at the flares. We pick up the flares. If I could get there. Yeah, buddy. Max flares and... Oh boy. Okay. Enjoying it thus far. Now, this is not the only setting, mind you. I think what we're looking for is to get back to the... The HAP-1, I guess, which is probably their submarine base of some kind. When it's all bearing down on so many levels, it's gotta be managed. You can't shake the pressure. Just make your peace with it. Don't let it take the wheel. Alright, we're at 79 oxygen. Oh, we found a pipe. So hopefully we're getting closer to our base. Oh, jeez! Oh, no, no, no! Okay, let's go over that if we can. There we go. We got it. Should, should I toss a flare? It feels really dark here! Okay. What, what, what is that? Oh, what the hell is that? Just fish, right? Just fish. Oh, okay, I fell. Okay! Thrust, thrust, Falcon. You gotta thrust. You gotta hip thrust like you've never hip thrust before, my friend. Uh, okay, go down. I mean, I'm not even sure this is where I'm supposed to be going, but... <laughs> for now, it's apparently leading somewhere. We have an opening. Okay, cool. Ah! Oh, oh. Okay, stop. Whatever you're doing, stop There's it. There's protocol for everything has to be something to fall back on second guessing puts lives at risk so it's best to stick to procedure step by step so with an all hands call you head straight for compass one try and reach surface from comms Ooh. is that somebody oh that's another person i think i love the the monologue too as you're going through this area, it's great. Benjamina Isra, 1989, junior diver, France, the seas. First for us, now Isra. Like me, she was out on Eva when this all started. Like me, she was probably headed back in search of others, or at least a little calm in the storm. I found her at the perimeter of Compass One, too close for comfort. Behind the shattered visor, her face was bathed in blue light. Quiet. It's not quite at peace. Another sleeper in the veil. A plain painful reminder of how little separates us from the elements. 
Something tells me this is his worst night. This is worst night, thought. Yeah, that would probably be a very good assumption to make. Let's stop looking at her body because apparently it is making me use up oxygen here. What? Um, hey, buddy. Yeah, yeah, you wanna? You wanna check out that? You wanna check out that flare? <gasps> Stab it! Okay, okay, relax, relax. No, 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 I stabbed. I stabbed you before you got to me, my friend. Okay, should we just go? I think we should just go. I think we should just go, either that or kill it. One or the other. Is it leaving? Oh, it's bleeding, all right. I just realized, is it bleeding a good thing? Would blood just attract something worse? You know what? I don't want to stick around to find out. You're falling apart. Tell me about it. I just saw a, a giant squid monster fly by. Oh god, oxygen. Oh, we made it to the compass one though. Oh, thank god. Awesome. All right, this is good. By the way, I haven't mentioned this. This is only a one shot, guys. If you enjoyed this, want to see some more, let me know in the comments. Let me know by leaving a like, and we might cover more of this going forward. What's the problem? Manual override? Yeah. You know what? Now, I'm not really too familiar with stuff like this at all. all kinds of drills. You... believe you know what to expect? Once I got inside, where it's familiar and you should feel safe. Even though I had to, those first few steps weren't easy. Yeah, I lost my train of thought, because he interrupted me and then I saw this. That's not a body, is it? No, it's just a suit. Okay. Oh boy. Um, oh yeah, I was gonna say the manual override. Normally, I'm not a pro at this, but I imagine if you have to do manual overrides to get back inside the base, yeah, it would look like this. So the base is not completely sunk as well. Alright, so that door seems inaccessible to us, and this is it right here. Alrighty, we're almost out of time, guys, so I'm just giving you guys a bit of a heads up here that we're gonna start wrapping it up kind of soon. But, before we do, let's try to go a bit further. Oh, yeah. Fire safety, huh? Yeah, I don't think fire is the... Fire's the least of our problems here for now, I'm gonna say. Cold storage. Unaccessible to us. Oop. Settle down there, my friend. I don't think we're gonna get... Hey! Hey! Yo, man, you weren't there before, okay? You- the game said no supernatural nonsense. Oh, it's freaking me out, okay. Don't- don't look at it. Just don't look at the body. Ooh, boy. Yeah, so far I'm really digging this. Great visuals, great atmosphere, great setting. Hey, buddy. You, you're fine, right? I will stab you with this knife fish, okay? I have stabbed before, I will stab again. Oh, no, never mind. Not, not, not a crab monster, though. That I don't think it's stab. Although, it doesn't seem to be moving. Those are flares. Yo, what about oxygen here? Okay, Fishman is fine. I don't think Fishman's gonna attack me. You're fine, right? Let's find out. Ah, you reacted light? I guess you died. You were probably, like, semi-crushed by that door. I momentarily heard. So is that a person? Oh, dude, that is a person. Oh boy. Liang Zhu Ching, 1976, born, date, biology researcher, Taiwan. We all met long before setting foot in Compass One. ADS training, briefings. Trust exercises. Dr. Leanne asked us to call her Susie right off the bat. Said it's easier to pronounce, but really she just couldn't stand people screwing up her real name. <laughs> yeah, like I just did. Looks like she grabbed an O2 tank and breather before climbing into the ventilation shaft. Clever. But she can't out with the ocean. After forcing its way in, it swept her literally off her feet and hung her out to dry. 
Oh boy. Did it ever. Okay. Where's... Oh, what's happening? No, 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 no. No, no, stop, stop. Okay, let, let's get out of here. This might be sinking. Let's just get out of here. If you want to see some more, definitely let me know, and we shall cover more of this going forward. But again, it's up to you guys. Let me know in the comments, let me know by leaving a like, and um, we shall cover more. Jesus Christ almighty, you were supposed to be immobile. Where are you going? Yo, man. I don't think I feel comfortable with a giant spider crab walking down the, the sunken shafts here. And he took the light with him, I think. Yo, he took the light with him. Alrighty, well, we're gonna wrap it up here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you wanna see some more, let me know in the comments. Let me know by leaving a thumbs up. And we shall cover more of this. Otherwise, Narcosis, all the information for it will be down below. I will catch you next time.